about Dr. Tucker is his way is a process. It's not an event where whenever you work with animals and anybody that knows me and has seen me work with animals, you always should make it a process. If you turn it into an event, nobody wins. People get hurt, horses get hurt, and the great thing about Doc T's technique, nobody gets hurt, the horses are treated as equals and not overpowered. Before working with Dr. Tucker, I have always tried to stay with the manual teeth floating, but unfortunately, more and more people think the power floating is the way to go. Unfortunately, in my past, um, I came across horses when I was head barn tech at an equine hospital of horses that were power floated, and we had issues of teeth being over floated, which caused a lot of choking, um, bad eating abnormalities or horses just not eating because they were not able to process the feeds um, as well as when horses are power floated they're very over tranquilized and they're tied up and there's times where the rope will give the horse will start to move and with those power tools we have seen broken jaws but with Dr. Tucker the horses are in a normal state of mind. They're able to stand square and keep all four legs underneath them so they can support their own body weight as opposed from being suspended from a beam. Um, it becomes a total process. And he can, with them being calm and cool and collected, he is calm, cool and collected and in turn can do the best service on your horse's teeth that is necessary. Oh yes. Yes, I would. I most definitely would. Oh, I have recommended him to a number of people um, just due to the philosophies. There's a, a lot of people that are real horsemen that are still looking for the right way to do things. Um, just because it's new and in the present doesn't always mean it's good. All people can benefit from the Tucker technique. All breeds of horses, all, um, all disciplines, everybody can benefit. There's no, nobody that can't.